right guys, I'm going to do part two of this video. Um, some of you recommended that I put on a second piece of cardboard, which is what I'm going to do. So what I did was make a cutout, uh, just more regular cardboard, you know, no box. <clears throat> what I'm going to do is reinforce the bottom part here so that when you're pushing the buttons, it has a little bit more uh, rigidity to it. So, I mean, it's pretty sturdy now, but... I put a bunch of stuff in there uh, just to let it bottom out, but I think it'll be a pretty good, uh, it'll be pretty sturdy once I reinforce it with this. And now I just have to match the holes up on this one. And Alright, so I just fast forwarded taking uh, the, all the buttons off just because it was easier. Alright, so I already wired the spider web's nest of all these wires for now. Uh, let's see if they're all going to light up. If not, I have to go back and switch the red and the black uh, just because the, you know they're not consistent with the orientation of the switches. So here, just plugging it into the Raspberry Pi and... I'm going to hook up a small fan here to the Raspberry Pi just to pull out some of the hot air. And I'm going to hook up the, hook that fan up to pin 1 and 40 on the GPIO from the Raspberry Pi. Um, Alright guys, so it's up and running pretty much. I did buy that monitor um, just because I wanted to have something to play with instead of the TV outside. Uh, it's a little 19 inch. Uh, I got it for like 60 bucks on eBay. It's, 14, it's 1368 by 768 I believe, so much better resolution than any game out there. That's pretty much it. I'll show you guys the next screen while I load the ROMs. I can't go into detail about how to do that, but you should be able to just Google that and find it on your own. And I'll show you the uh, internals. So basically, it was, you know, it was pretty easy. It was pretty plug and play. Um, 
like I said, all I did was double up the cardboard here. There's the mess of wires. Uh, once I, I mean, I'm pretty much ready to just put everything together. Right now, I do have a pie out here just to make it uh, easier to put the memory card in and out. I did have to get this uh, VGA to HDMI adapter for the monitor to work. Um, the first one I got didn't work, but you know, maybe that's why I paid three bucks for it. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please do uh, like and subscribe. I'm still uh, <laughs> kind of a new YouTube content creator, so I need as much help from you guys as possible to try and, uh, you know, get more views and likes and all that good stuff. Uh, leave a comment for what I should do next, and thanks for watching.